<laughs> Hello, this is Wanda from Wanda.tv, and today I want to talk about The Division 2. The Division 2, the number two looter shooter this year. The first was Anthem, and the next is this game called Division 2. Now, I'm going to show you my, or talk about my first 20 hours, first 20 hour impression. I kind of did a similar thing for Anthem, where I, I played the game for a little bit, and I gave you my impressions on what the game was so far. Uh, and we're going to do the same for The Division 2. Uh, first 20 hours. So, I can tell you right off the bat that if you've come in from if you're coming from division one a lot of the feedback you've probably been hearing is that division two looks and feels a lot like division one and that some people even exclaim that is nothing more than a big bloated dlc and i gotta say when you first come in for the first 10 or 20 hours that's true it's true in the fact that you definitely will see a lot of similarities between the two games they play exactly the same cover systems the same the gunplay you know has, has some tweaks the guns have different sounds and whatnot but from an overall perspective it's pretty much d1 but honestly i don't think that's a bad thing i think that's actually a good thing the longer you play the game and i think i started to notice this around the 10 to 15 hour mark and, uh you start to notice all the little systems and improvements from division one a lot the biggest example i can think of is just how much stuff there is to do and how alive the world feels uh, from everything from the control point takeovers to just uh how the how these different factions are vying for control or territory uh the dynamic events i mean there's some similarities with like with supply drops and things like that but the more you play the more you notice that there's a lot of little things that have been added over time and it feels good it's a good formula I, I found that when i got to about 16 17 hours i was like man i'm really enjoying the side quests i'm liking these little side things that i have to do i'm not really in a rush to to get to 30 i'm not really in a rush to, to get to the to the meat and potatoes of the end game which i've told has been really good but i'm about you know that 20 hour mark and i'm feeling really you know addicted to the game based on what it has to offer right now i've hit some walls with the gear grind it's kind of forced me to craft forced me to learn stats and that fixes it's forced me to try out different weapons it's forced me to explore different parts of the game that you know in division one i wouldn't even care to dream about and i actually think this game is better than division one especially the first beginning it feels a lot more fluid it feels a lot more uh, polished as it should it's a sequel it, it, i'm going to talk about it i mean everybody's going to compare this game to anthem they say you know hey one is this game just like anthem or is it you know better than anthem is it worse than anthem and uh the first 20 hours i think it's a resounding yes it's better than anthem it's a much tighter game is it's, it's got some instability i mean there were some bugs with with skills not not going off like they should and uh the game has some st some performance issues for me overall just like division one did but nowhere near the caliber of what anthem had anthem had a really disastrous launch from a technical standpoint and i think division was a, a lot better than that i think a division division is a lot more accessible and uh, you have a lot more to look forward to uh you have a, a, a more of a i guess you could say more of a motivation to grind uh the, the gear that you get in division two there's 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 little to no ambiguity as to why you're doing what you're doing uh you're just grinding gear to get more gear i mean and the stories aren't like groundbreaking they're fun to do but if you don't pay attention you're not going to miss much and i think if you do pay attention you're probably not going to gain that much either it's a looter shooter i generally don't care about story anyway uh i thought anthem had an average story in some ways better than average but you know at the end of the day you know a few weeks from now a couple months from now i'm not going to be remembering what happened in the story i'm just going to be trying to get that better gun get that better chess piece get that set piece you know it's all it's all about the loot grind the story is there for you know good reason we're gonna get more dlc this year but from an overall standpoint i just really think that uh the story is not super important so the first 20 hours it's a resounding yes big thumbs up i've been recommending this game to so many people been telling them about it uh giving them recommendations on what to do if they get stuck like one of the things i learned in the first 20 hours is that when you get to a point to where you're getting destroyed by bosses or even just you know you're trying to do a public event you're getting destroyed go and craft something you know i, I never knew like in games like this you just ignore crafting until you get the end game crafting actually helps if you've unlocked some recipes doing side quests go in there craft some gear and you'll get a, a very cheap very easy stat boost to get you through those early missions that can be that can be very very daunting uh you don't have to group you can do solo that's another good thing about this game um i did the majority of the first 20 hours solo uh i've learned to do matchmaking more i've been playing with some of the community members a little bit we did like a full day one saturday of just playing and we got about five to ten levels doing that but overall it's a it's a great experience either solo or with people and i think it's a solid game it's, it's solid through and through it's it's the best looter shooter that's come out this year of the two some people calling the game of the year i don't know about that yet but uh i haven't gotten to in 
game. I've been distracted by other games as I tend to be with uh, the streaming thing that I'm doing. But uh, overall, I think Division is, is looking really good so far and I'm looking good to the end game. This is one from one.tv. This is Division 2, the first 20 hours and my impression. Take care. Have a great day. If you enjoyed the video, click that subscribe button and ring the bell for updates. Follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash buona, youtube.com slash buona right here. Also at twitch.tv slash buona, I have a live stream that I do every day pretty much. Head over there, subscribe to those outlets, and check out my podcast at buona.tv slash podcast. Have a great day.